I think it would work great with FPV. There's no pilot in the cockpit already, so yep. easily you can Woo. peel that cockpit back and just pop a camera in there. Mm -hmm. Maybe a pan and tilt. Whoa! <laughs> we are. Are y'all playing demolition derby? I we think like so. to live dangerously, <laughs> Manny. <laughs> Pilots, welcome back to Motion RC. It's James along with Patrick Crosdale. It's been a while, Patrick. Been He's been away for big business, big <laughs> Air Force type business for a little while, so we hadn't had a chance to fly uh, with them. But first day we had to get out, I said, we've never done it yet. We haven't done tandem. Uh, Dora and P-51 from Flightline. Um, you guys have seen the flight reviews. Patrick flew the P-51 mm -hmm. flight review and things awesome. I think I did the flight review for the Dora just as awesome and we just did a flight before where <laughs> we were having a lot of fun. It's almost too dangerous because they're like magnets in the sky. They want to find each other. But guys, if you haven't experienced uh, this model, these models, um, to actually, Patrick, you tell me what you like about the P-51. Uh, honestly, I love its scale appearance. I love its size too. It's easy to keep in the back of the truck or your car. Uh, if you're at work, you can just go out to the local field, throw it up, and off you go. I like the small batteries, too. It's easy to charge. It's simple. Everything about this airplane is simple, yet still really fun. Yeah, and the beauty of it, out of the box, you could go 3S or 4S. So today we're flying on 2200 4Ss. Um, that's where we like it. It's a little windy today, so we both have, I don't know if you have the Admiral Gyro, but I, I have, Admiral Gyro, yeah. we have Admiral Gyro stability, and I have it on a switch, so I can turn it on and off as needed, but on a day like today, might as well have it on. And my favorite thing about these two, I think, is just like the foam detail, the level of detail on these compared to previous uh, fun jets or fun fighters in the past. It's just, I mean, these are the quality of your bigger flight line birds just in a nice small package. Now the Dora comes out of the box like this, decals all ready to go. The uh, P-51 is going to come out of the box all silver. You got to decal it up and then for the two schemes in included in the box, you will have to just paint the tail either green or yellow if you wanted to go with either Shangri-La uh, had the yellow tail or the Enchantress which had the green one. But the reason they did that because Mustangs are so many <laughs> schemes you could do mm -hmm. and we knew guys would want to do that and keep Cali graphics busy <laughs> because uh, we've seen some cool schemes for that but we're just gonna do a tandem fight flight guys have some fun and I don't know I've been getting about eight minutes easy on a 22 and when we land we could be up even more but uh let's go fly it now all right ready just do it taking off and we are right at low rate yeah. And we're up now. Stand next to me, Patrick, okay, so they can I'm gonna see. Okay, stand in. There we go. That lovely face. <laughs> I'm coming around. Okay. Right down the runway, and Patrick's right on me already. I'm about Woo! half throttle. <laughs> let's speed it up. Okay. Now let's stay at full throttle. Okay. For this pass. All right. Just try to. Oh, oh. we're so gonna hit on this flight <laughs> just because we're filming it. Here we are. Oh. Ready? Power's in. Power's in. Oh, Woo! Going vertical. Okay. Let's drop it down and come back across ourselves. Okay. Power down, full throttle now. There we go. They're so much fun. They look so good <laughs> in the sky. They do. Hey, can I speak? Is Tom we were trying. Ooh. <laughs> That's what you want. If I'm telling you, you get two of them up and it's like magnets. It's just so much fun to put them close to each other. <laughs> it's too fun to not try to get dangerous. Let's go vertical into the field. Three, two, one, pull Up it. There we go. Look at the power. Oh, okay. On a 2200, Roll. I mean, that's stupid. And pull. Down she comes. Now glide it. Nope. Okay, idle. gliding, gliding, We're gliding. We're idle. Hey, what's up, Tom? This man. Oh, yeah. That was Put great. The power back. <laughs> that's that was awesome. Fun. <laughs> it's so good when I could fly any which way and Patrick's just good enough to stay with me. Two's in. <laughs> The only problem with this flight is we don't have 16 of them in this Oh, sky. man. How cool would that be, uh, right? I'm hoping, Dalton, if you guys have them, if you're Woo! coming to the Jolly Good Flying at the end of August, okay. hopefully Patrick will be able to join us for at least one day, but I yeah. hope a bunch of guys have these because I'd love to do a little streamer combat or even just demolition combat. Yeah, demolition combat. <laughs> it's 129 bucks. If you're in this hobby, that's like, that's nothing. Look at us. And those gyros really working? <laughs> They're working today because it is windy. 
especially above our tree line. Yeah, let's give a nice roll here. Up over the top. Barrel roll. Oh. <laughs> you know, these, these airplanes make me want to make airplane noises. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we're big kids. Big kids. Going to guns. I guess only have guns on these, I'm right? Going vertical. <laughs> yeah, right. Said we need lasers. Oh. Up I really think this platform would cater to FPV. Oh man, I think it would work great with FPV. There's no pilot in the cockpit already, so yep. easily you can peel that cockpit back and just pop a camera in there. Mm -hmm. Maybe a pan and tilt. Whoa! Whoa. <laughs> we are. Are y'all playing demolition derby? I we think like so. to live dangerously, Manny. <laughs> I know Alpha's probably like, I hope they crash and we'll make a better video. Because <laughs> if they crash, I could clickbait them with crash <laughs> on the top. Second you put crash on a video, more people watch. Now we come together again. Rolling. You got power in, I'll put it in. Woo! <laughs> the speed on now, this Now, does it sound like your prop is out of balance a little bit? Uh, possibly. I may or may not have struck the ground with it once. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I was landing at the, on the pavement a lot at this other airport. My tips of my prop are all sorts of jacked up. Woo! That was gorgeous. <laughs> I saw your shadow on me. That looked great. Invert it. <laughs> well, he's hot dog, and I'll go gun him. <laughs> I got a hot dog. Yeah, I don't want Bob Hoover behind me. If I'm in an FW 190. Here we go. Woo! They're just too much fun, man. This is exactly what you're supposed to do with these things, guys. Grab a friend at your field. Yeah. Say, you're buying this one, I'm buying that one. <laughs> and we're going to do this. I like how Every time. you can do it on the cheap, you know? Like, it's, it's not expensive. You can, you can get uh, less expensive re gyro receivers in it. You get 2200s, which are less expensive, and an airframe that's really simple to, to throw a couple bucks down on, and off you go. Yeah, I mean, so what? It's 129 for the frame, mm -hmm. for the airframe. You got $30 for the Admiral Stability Plus gyro. And then a 2200 4S, what, 19 maybe? I think so, yeah. So all in about 180? Something like that, and yeah. You're like ready to go. And again, just put it in the back of your car. I'm trying to loop around Whoa! him up. I can't get behind him. <laughs> now we're dog it. Dog ah! fighting it. Oh, up and over. <laughs> this is awesome. You know, for guys that want to throw the rudder on there too, add that just touch more maneuverability with it. Yeah, well the P-51 does have a tube already embedded in the mm -hmm. foam mm -hmm. and a uh, servo place in the, uh, in the battery canopy or the mm -hmm. um, I'm sorry the plate mm -hmm. hard to talk while you're flying <laughs> but uh, you know in the plate the servo cutouts already there so you can easily get it in the p51 and then the door you just have to do a little extra work to it if you wanted to go that route but you know the beauty about let's do some slow flight okay. on the next pass yeah let's slow it down to half throttle okay and let's play within the f within the trees we'll sure get low and you can just see man you can bring this easily to a park and especially if you guys who want to fly on 3S, 3S 16 to 22, you'll be fine. I mean, I'm just going to keep yeah. it at half throttle okay. and just play. Yeah. I and mean, you could do figure eights within the field all day. I'm and even play. on a windy day, that gyro just it's working. keeps it dialed in. I'm going to play follow the leader here. Or if we say in uh, formation flying in the military, two's in. <laughs> Just that. easy flying, fun airplanes. Little figure eights. In the product video, when before they cut the grass out there, there was nothing but like dandelions all around, <laughs> and it just looked so good. It looked like a German field, German field <laughs> in World War II. Ooh. I'm gonna play, and then on my next turn, okay. I'm gonna just gun it and go vertical and hit it. Okay. Here we go. Coming in and gun it. All right. Out of dodge. Two's in. <laughs> That's what I love too, guys. If you notice on the hand launch, I just went full throttle and just let her go. Yep. I mean, she will just, as long as you're 45 degree angle is where I am when I let go. But I'm like, I don't think I'm putting any arm energy into a hand launch, if you will, like you would a park jet, you mm -hmm. know? A jet, you need that initial energy to get the air through the motor, 
through the fan, but with a prop job like this, it just it leaves just your hand. Yeah. Just leaves your hand. And we are still up. I don't even know what <laughs> my time is. I haven't heard my timer beat. I'll take a glance here on this pass. Uh, I've got a minute left. A minute left. And where was your timer set? Uh, seven minutes is what I usually you have, have mine set at. I'm yeah. at 7.30. Because when we were out here that one day just doing slow flight, just I think going. I was up for 12 minutes. <laughs> like it just, I just went to LVC and just, let it go. Yeah, glided in. That's beauty. Is that's how I land this one? Is I, I just idle throttle and let it come down. Yeah, let it sit. And if you can land on grass, it's gonna help your prop mm -hmm. better. I think one time I landed on pavement and broke a prop from just the torque. Or actually, one time I landed on pavement. And it loosened my prop. <laughs> so, you know, it spun it the opposite way. I've got Look 30 that. seconds counting left on mine. Perfect. So now winds seem to be coming out They're of the left. So picking up a little bit, yeah. Let's change our flight pattern. Sure. Now we're going right to left. All right. We're we going to line it up? You can line it up and I'll come in behind you. Okay. I'll just do one pass over you. Pretend I'll like I up. shot you down. <laughs> and I'll land right to left. Come Gotta in. Got to watch the pilot. So I've got a little bit of power, and then I go idle throttle right here, and I just let it come in. And flare. Ooh, a little wind. Boop. Down she is. <laughs> All right. Now I'm up. I'm, I am throttle off. So I am idle. And I'll bring it back in if I need it. But for the most part, you don't need it. Boop. There it is. <laughs> Look at that. Come on. There it is, awesome. Patrick. Awesome flying. You got that, Alex? Oh, was I rolling? Should I be rolling? <laughs> Alex forgot to be rolling. So if he wasn't, you just watch us talk about it because it was that good. But guys, thanks so much for joining us. Expect more videos coming soon. And again, we have that jolly good flying coming up in uh, late August. So we'll be doing tons of video from there and then all in the fall coming up and probably some new products coming your way as well. But right now, Flightline Dora, Flightline P51. If you want to have some fun, you can't beat it. See you guys soon.